Okay, folks, we're back again to do another unboxing of comics for the shop this week. Uh, I'm going to start with Penguin Random House distribution. Got this very thin mailer. This is going to be some kind of promotional object, I have a feeling. What do we got? What do we got? It's an envelope. Hmm. 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 Uh. Oh. It's Ninja Turtle pins. That's a Ninja Turtle, right? A mask for a turtle. Let's see. Yes. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle promo pins. Okay. Next, we'll go for the mailer. And this is the IDW mailer. Star Trek Defiant, number 17. That's a good cover. And we have... Godzilla versus Mighty Morphin Power Rangers 2, number 4. And this is a very thick mailer. As far as mailers go, this one's a thick one. Well. Daintily packaged, got the invoice. This is going to be Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number 1. In this one I didn't go huge on that um, hope I got enough I don't know it's a hard call anyway this is cover C looks to be by Kevin Eastman if I had to guess I should know these things I shouldn't have to guess but anyways guess we shall here is uh, the blank cover it's quite blank it's got the regular cover underneath. And here's the regular cover for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Number one, cover A. Let's take a look inside of this sucker. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number one. How very exciting. And that's your art. I don't want to show the last page. That's your art for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number one. And here we have Wolverine number 88, facsimile edition. This is, of course, to promote the Deadpool movie. And here's the very shiny foil variant for Wolverine 88, facsimile edition. Okay, now we go to the box, which looks like it's taking a little damage, but nothing too bad. Well. And we've got the packing paper all the way around, so the comics should be safe. Hooray. All right. entire contents of that box and off we go masters of the universe revolution number three that's not selling here at all i don't know why deadpool wolverine world war three or ww3 i would assume that means world war but who knows uh, this is a variant here is a Deadpool and Wolverine. Wait, this is Deadpool. This is not World War Three, is it? What is going on here? What is this? Dear God, this is Captain America number eleven. <laughs> I 
Uh, of course, it has Deadpool and Wolverine on the cover. Um, a tribute cover to uh, Hulk 340. Here is Marvel Zero. Number one or number zero or whatever that is. Well, it looks like I have... Okay, no, no, okay. We'll take a look inside this. Got some Blood Hunters, got some X Men stuff, multiple stories. So that's your interior art for Marvel Zero. Cover price $6.99 with a cover for a cover. Annihilation $20.99. I believe this is the first um, appearance of Silver Surfer 2099 or someone has Silver Surfer 2099. That was number four. Did I find out there's another one? Uh, Strange Academy Blood Hunt, number three of three. Got a couple of those. Captain America, number 11. The actual real cover. The main cover. The cover that actually has the freaking name of the comic on it. Venom. Separation Anxiety number three. I don't like this upside down. This Venomverse Reborn number two. So is this pronounced NYX or Nix? I'm going to go with Nix. Number one, this is a, I uh, believe, art germ variant. I could be wrong on that. Uh, anyhow, that is a variant. Wolverine Blood Hunt, number four. Darth Vader, number 48. Moon Knight, number seven. And here's the regular cover for Nick's number one. Looks to be more about uh, Kamala Khan than anything else. So anyways, that's that. And they sent some preview, some free copies of this last week, if you recall. You saw that one. So we got plenty of copies of that now. Uh, Ultimate Black Panther, number six. Another one of those. Deadpool, Wolverine, WW3, number three. Should have several of these. These are selling briskly. So that's uh, that's the shipment from Penguin Random House, and I'm uh, moving on to the Lunar Distribution shipment. Bubble wrap all around, box inside box, perfectly packaged as always. Thank you for being Lunar Lunar. This one's heavy, so it's got more comics than the other the other one. Of course, Lunar does not only DC now; they've got several other publishers that have, are on board with them now you know for example of these other publishers flash gordon number one and that's a good cover look at that sucker and that is by mad cave we'll take a look inside and hopefully the, uh, it looks pretty good gosh that's the art in Flash Gordon, number one. Problem here is I'm running out of, now that we're carrying these uh, other publishers now, not just the Marvel and DC, I'm running out of shelf space for all these titles. Void Rivals, number 11. Uh... Creature from the Black Lagoon, 
lives. That's number four. And that is the variant cover. Here is the regular cover. That's good stuff. Cardstock cover. Tabby tabby. And $4.99 cover price. Here's a big old bundle of the DC Connect. That's your DC catalog. So you'll know what's coming out. You can alert your comic shop. So they'll know what you're uh, going to buy. So they can plan for it. Hate Revisited. Number two. Peter Baggy. Flash Gordon number one blank variant. Does it have the regular cover inside? It does not. Wait, maybe it does. It does not. So there's that. Spawn kills every spawn. Number one blank variant. Let's see. Spawn kills every spawn. Number one. This is cover B by McFarlane. Since it is spawn, it is cardstock tappy tappy and only two ninety nine cover price. Is this the regular cover? This is the regular cover. Spawn kills every spawn. We'll take a look inside. Okay, it's not what I expected. It's just like that. Uh, the cover suggests it is, which is not a bad thing, I guess. But anyway. That's your art in Spawn Kills Every Spawn, number one. Got a few of those. They'll sell, I'm confident. Rook Exodus, number four. No one. Number ten. King Spawn, number 36. Again, 299, card stock, tabby tabby. Two of those, because why not? They're only three bucks. Zaytana, bring down the house. Book two. It is five ninety nine, but Tappy Tappy reveals it is also cardstock. Power Girl number eleven. Nice house by the sea. Book one, I'm assuming this is part of the uh, that whole thing with the nice house by the lake. I would think this is probably the second part. Very flimsy cover. $4.99 cover price. And that's your art in nice house by the sea. Harley Quinn number 42. This is a cardstock variant. Tabby tabby. Harley Quinn, number 42. This is a cardstock variant. Tappy Tappy. Harley Quinn, number 42. This is the regular cover. Not cardstock. Tappy. This is the last stack. More Harley Quinn, 42s. Green Arrow, number... 14, Jose Garcia Lopez variant, that is for me, I shall keep it, Green Arrow number 14, Flash number 11, Jose Luis Garcia Lopez variant, also for me, Flash number 11 regular cover, Detective Comics, starring the Batman, number 1087, Batman Brave and the Bold, number 15, big old $7.99 cover price, it is square bound, cardstock tappy tappy, Batman Dark Age,
Come on. Come, come, come here. Dang it. Dang it. Okay, Batman Dark Age, number four. Phone's ringing. And last, we have Task Force 7, number two of seven. So that's our show for the week, kids. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. See you at the comic shop. Bye.